So here you can see that there's certain theme applied to this. And let's say I want to change the theme uh, of the overall design. So what I can simply do is I can go to the design section right here and you can see that there are different variants of theme that I can choose from. So I can go over here and you can see that there's modern theme and if, as I hover onto it, you can see that it actually changes just like that. So I can go over here and choose any theme that I want. So let's say I want to choose uh, this variant right here, click it and the theme has been changed. And if I want the variance for the theme, I can go over here and there's different colors that I can choose from as you can see right here. So the design is the same, you can choose a different color and a different process will actually come in. There's also effects that you can apply uh, and so forth. So you can see that you can, you can actually have different style of data and different type of connectors as well. So you can go to connectors and you can see that there are different type of connectors that you can choose uh, from and apply that as well. So besides that, what you can do is you can override some of the themes yourself. So I can, I can simply go over here uh, into one of these shapes and let me go to home right here and here you can see that there are variants so I can go over here change and override the theme right here and let's say for example I'm going to change it to something like red so now uh, if I were to go to themes now if I were to go to design you can see that I can still select themes but you can see that right now the same theme is applied but it is a bit different than other shapes as you can see. So this is red, this is blue, but if I were to apply another theme, you can see that that particular shape is a bit different than others in some. For example, in this one, you can see that the uh, start and end theme is different for stop and the start is color change. So if I were to uh, choose other colors as well, so you can see that the um, this one is a bit different. This may not be seen in all of the shapes right here, but it is definitely different than the rest of the shape right there. So that is how you can utilize theme and styles inside of Microsoft Visio. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.